Welcome to the Abiding Word broadcast. Well, bless the Lord. Thank you for joining us today for the Abiding Word broadcast. I'm Evangelist Dudley Smith, and I'm so glad that you've joined us today for this program. You're going to be blessed today by our anointed music on the program, and you're going to be edified by the preaching and teaching of the Word of God. And at the end of the program, you don't want to go anywhere. We're going to be praying just for you. Praise the name of God. So stay with us. We're going to get started right after this message. The Camp Meeting Spirit is alive and well in our classic video, Dudley Smith at Camp Meeting. Your spirit will soar as you experience the high praises of God and feel the presence of the Lord in this Camp Meeting music. Testimonies have declared many healings, breakthroughs, and deliverances while watching this exciting video. Bring Pentecost into our life and home today by getting your copy of this powerful music, Dudley Smith at Camp Meeting. Go to our website at www.dudleysmith.net and click the DSM Music and Book tab. Order your copy now.
Hello there. <laughs> so glad that you're back with us again. Praise the name of God. My God, we've been shouting, we've been praising, we've been blessing the name of the Lord for His goodness. I sure hope, I sure hope that you are taking uh, the time to bless the Lord. Hallelujah. For He is good and His mercy endured forever. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless His holy name. Praise God. Glory to God. Are you worshiping Him today? Well, you say, I don't have a reason to worship. Yes, you do. Hallelujah. Because if he hadn't been good to you yet today, which I know he has, just hang on a minute. It's getting ready to get real good. <laughs> Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God. We've been talking about the story of Jesus in Capernaum where he went into the synagogue and he began to teach with authority. And there was a devil sitting in there that was uh, hidden by and, and, and by all accounts. And uh, he began to cry out to Jesus and to con front Jesus and he wanted to be left alone because he couldn't stand the power of God and Jesus confronted him glory to God with authority and cast him out praise the name of God hallelujah to God and we've been talking about how that we don't have to settle for the devil staking his claim in our life and being comfortable in our life you see you don't need to make the devil comfortable in your life but it's time to expose that rascal time to expose that unclean spirit that demon uh, activity whatever uh, that's uh, 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 hindering your walk with God time to expose it and cast it out praise God let's read uh, our base scripture for uh, this teaching for this this sermon we're gonna uh, see how far we can get with it uh, uh, today glory to God and you're gonna be blessed praise God in Mark chapter 1 verses 21 through 27 Here's what the word of God said. And they went into, uh, into Capernaum and, and straightway on the Sabbath day he entered into the synagogue and taught. And they were astonished at his doctrine for he taught them as one that had authority and not as the scribes. And there was in their synagogue a man with an unclean spirit. And he cried out saying, let us alone. What have we to do with thee, thou Jesus of Nazareth? Art thou come to destroy us? I know thee who thou art, the Holy One of God. And Jesus rebuked him, saying, Hold thy peace, and come out of him. And when the un unclean spirit uh, had torn him and cried with a loud voice, he came out of him. And when they were all amazed, uh, uh, they were all amazed, rather, insomuch that they questioned among themselves, saying, What thing is this? What new doctrine is this? For with authority commanded he even the unclean spirits, and they do obey him. Praise the name of God. Did you, did you catch the last end of that? The unclean spirits do obey him. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. The devil cannot reside in your life and stay in your life. Hallelujah. When the power of God has come. Glory to God. Every knee and every sh uh, tongue shall bow and confess that Jesus is Lord. Praise God. Everything that's in your life that uh, 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 it's from the devil. Glory to God. That is from the devil. Hallelujah to God. Sickness and disease. Glory to God. Uh, has to bow and say Jesus is Lord. It has to confess that Jesus is the final authority in life's matters. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. And this story we have been talking about, hallelujah, how the devil had been exposed as Jesus was teaching in a synagogue. Well, let's kind of go back and just kind of recap some things that Jesus had been teaching in the synagogue with authority. Praise God. I like to say with unction. Hallelujah. With the power of the Holy Spirit. He was teaching. Glory to God. With, with, with authority. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And there was a man that was sitting in there. Glory to God. That carried a spirit. An unclean spirit. Praise God. Hallelujah to God. And let me stop right there and say this. Glory to God. In case you did not catch the earlier uh, programs. Glory to God, that an unclean spirit doesn't just mean you're doing unclean things. Glory to God, but an unclean spirit can also be, hallelujah, the spirit of the devil uh, or demon spirits that oppose the purity and the holiness of God in your life. Praise the name of God. The devil always tried to do, or always is opposite, put it that way, of what God is. The devil is always opposite of what God is. The devil wants to always establish the opposite of what God 
has established. Glory to God. And the purity, hallelujah, of holiness that God is trying to instill in our life, the devil wants to do otherwise. And that's why it is called unclean. Now, there are some other th unclean things that the enemy does, you know, such as perversions and such habits. And these things, sexual immoralities and things, these are unclean spirits too because certainly they, epit they epit uh, epitomize the fact that uh, 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 they're doing opposite of what God had commanded and the holiness that he's commanded for our life. This thing was sitting in this man's uh, life and in the, this man was a church goer. Get that. We're not talking about somebody that wasn't going to church that didn't come to the church often. This man was a probably a regular in the church. Praise God, but he had some problems on the inside. Glory to God, but he could not be comfortable and couldn't sit still when the man of God, full of power, hallelujah to God, and the word came. He cried out and said, what do we have to do with you? Did you come to destroy us? Is that why you're here? We're not bothering anybody. We're not disturbing nothing. You see, the devil thinks just because he, you know, he tried to play nice. You know, the devil tried to play nice, but in all actuality, he's not. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. When the sickness comes into your life, you know, sometimes it try to play nice and give you one or two or three good feeling days, but it's still there. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. He can be dealt with when the power and the presence of God shows up. <laughs> Hallelujah to God. I don't know about you, but I want him to show up every day in my life. Glory to God. Bring your power, Lord. Bring your power. Hallelujah. Let me feel your presence, Lord, in all of its fullness as much as we can stand it. Hallelujah to God forevermore. Oh, to be in his presence. Hallelujah. I, I like being where there's a move of God. Praise God. And I, I'm praying that you have a move of God in your life today. I'm really praying that you will have a sovereign move of God in your life. Bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. They're sitting in there and they're now they're crying out and they're saying, we know who you are. You're the Holy One of God. Even the devil recognized Jesus. We talked about that. Now let's move on. Hallelujah. As Jesus cast the devil out of the man. Glory to God. There was a reaction. I began to talk about this. Hallelujah. Last program. There was a reaction that the devil uh, 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 began to exhibit as uh, he was commanded to leave the man. Praise God. We'll pick it up uh, uh, in verse number 25. Glory to God of Mark chapter 1. And, and, and the word says, And Jesus rebuked him, saying, Hold thy peace, and come out of him. Jesus gave him a direct command. Gave him a direct command and told him, praise God, to come out and hold his peace and come out. And when the demon heard that, the Bible says in verse 26, and when the unclean spirit, now here's the unclean spirit reacting to the command of God, he had torn him. Praise God. How many times has the Holy Spirit spoken to you to do something and you're torn about it? Praise God. Glory to God. I'm, I'm just kind of using that. Hallelujah. How the devil uh, 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 seeks to uh, continue to to, 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 to influence your life even after there's been a command given to him. Glory to God, doubt and unbelief. This man certainly physically torn, grappling on the floor, praise God. The hallelujah. Came out and he was cried with a loud voice, the word says. And then he came out, praise God. It was an excruciating thing, praise God, for this demon to let go of this man. But God had commanded him. This man, this man probably carried this spirit for many, many, many years and could probably be called, uh, uh, be termed of what we would call a familiar spirit. Glory to God. And this man was comfortable with it. Hallelujah to God. And said, I'm not letting go. Praise the name of God. This brings to mind, praise God, an instance that I experienced uh, uh, in uh, in Oklahoma, I was preaching a, a message, and I can't, I don't remember the town. I think it was McAllen, uh, Oklahoma. Praise God! And I was preaching this uh, revival at a high school. 
praise God. And um, oh my, we were having a move of God and, 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 and teachers were getting uh, saved, praise God. And people were getting miracles, praise God. And there was a lady that was there, glory to God, that had cancer, glory to God. And she was one of the teachers, glory to God. And we prayed for her, hallelujah. And God began to heal her, praise the name of God. Well, I remember we had had a tremendous service, glory to God, on a, I think it was Saturday night, praise God. Or whatever night it was, I don't remember. Praise God. And I was going uh, back to the vehicle to go back to the hotel after the service. And the demon spirit spoke to me and said, I've been here for 200 years and I'm not leaving. And I, 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 I said, uh, uh, you're going to do exactly what Jesus commanded you. You're letting people go. People are going to be healed. Kids are going to get delivered and saved and set free. Oh, the devil was mad because the power of God has shown up. Oh, my Lord God. Hallelujah. When the power of God shows up, hallelujah to God, the devil's got to let go. <laughs> Amen to God. Glory to God. And he was mad. Glory to God. And he tried to convince me, hallelujah, that he was a spirit of what he called outlaw. You know what an outlaw was back in the days of the Western days? They did everything illegal. They, they took and they stole. Praise God. Yeah, that's what the devil is. He comes to steal, kill, and destroy. He's an outlaw. He tries to operate outside the law of God. He tried to operate outside the promise of God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But Jesus was casting him out, out of those people's lives. Oh, my God. I feel the spirit here today. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And God's going to rebuke that spirit of outlaw out of your life. Praise the name of God. Whatever the case that he's um, uh, bothered you with for all these many years and months and days. Hallelujah to God. Oh, there's going to be deliverance. <laughs> I know what I know. Praise Jesus. Glory to God. He was upset, but it didn't stop Jesus from getting the victory, from having the victory. Because we understand that Jesus is the final authority. He is that final authority. And so we don't have to grapple with that. Glory to God. This thing now becomes personal between Jesus and the devil. Are you hearing me? And how many know Jesus is going to win every time? Every time, praise the name of God. He's come to take the fight uh, for you. Jesus has come to take the fight for you, to step in for you. Because you've been beat up, you've been knocked around, you've been stomped on, you've been uh, rolled over. Hallelujah to God. And you've been losing this battle day after day. Hallelujah. But Jesus says, hallelujah, come all ye that are labored, that, that labor and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Glory to God. Come over here and let me step in for you. And I'm going to fight for you. You shall hold your peace. Jesus said, now fight for you. Hallelujah. So now the battle is not yours, but the battle is the Lord. Glory to God. This demon spirit is grappling and he's twisting and he's tearing at the man. Glory to God. The Bible says, and he cried with a loud voice when he made his last, last, last attempt uh, to gain hold in this man's life. Pardon me. He came out. He left. He had to do ultimately what God told him to do. You have to be healed when we pray because we believe and we want you to believe and if you believe with us you got to be healed when you believe with us you got to be delivered hallelujah to god that's just the way it is hallelujah the devil may go through a bunch of changes and that's all right but it must be so <laughs> So what do you want to do? Praise God. You want to remain like you are? Stay sick? Stay, stay, stay bound up? Is that what you want? Praise God. Or you want to be set free? You want to be healed? You want to be made whole? You can be. Hallelujah. Just like that thing left that man, these things can leave you and he will leave you. The Bible says in verse 27, glory to God. And they were all amazed. <laughs> they were all amazed. Oh, my God. What a testimony. You know, so-and-so uh, 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 -so has been sitting in church all these years. And I didn't know he had this thing going on with him. Glory to God. I didn't know. He never said anything. Praise God. But my God, my, he got delivered today. Praise the name of God. 
Oh, wouldn't that be a wonderful testimony? You know, you've been sick for so long. Glory to God, you've been bound for so long. But all of a sudden, your breakthrough came. Your miracle showed up today. <laughs> Hallelujah. Your miracle showed up. God touched and he healed you and he blessed you and he set you free. Praise the name of Jesus. Oh, what a testimony. Praise God. Our testimonies make fat the bones. The Bible says, hallelujah to God. They had never seen anything like this before at Capernaum. They began to question with themselves and say to themselves, what thing is this? I've never seen this before. Praise God. You know, God's in the business of showing you stuff. Hallelujah. Showing you deliverances and healings and things that you have never experienced before. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. They were asking what new doctrine is this. No, it's not a new doctrine. Praise God. It's stuff that God's been doing for thousands of years. Praise God. God is the same yesterday, today, and forever. I sing the song, What He Is, I Will Never Change. Uh, glory to God. I like the other song, and everybody likes the song that I sing. That's the kind of God that I say you can, uh, 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 he's there when you need him. You can stand on his word. Praise God. That's the kind of God we serve. He's a healing God, a delivering God, a saving God, a baptizing in the Holy Spirit God. Hallelujah to God. My God. He's a victory bringing God. <laughs> yes. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. They were wondering about it. Praise the name of God. But the interesting thing about the whole thing is what we started off today's program with. Hallelujah to God. That when he commanded the spirits, these unclean spirits, when he commanded the devil, they obeyed him. Now, glory to God. Understand this. Hallelujah to God. The Holy One of God, Jesus, makes a command and has made a command against the enemy in your life. He's made that command, bless the name of Jesus, hallelujah to God, and the devil has to obey him. <laughs> oh, there's no debate about it. The devil has to obey him. Praise God. And he's going to, he's going to obey him. You are, you hear what I'm saying? Because God promised me, you are going to get a miracle. You are going to get healing. You are going to get it, and I believe that you're going to get it today. You're going to get it right now. Oh, some of you can already feel the presence of God. Hallelujah, right there where you are. <laughs> you, you, you can feel it right You can feel him moving right now. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. You're getting ready to get that breakthrough. Yes, you are. Hallelujah, because the devil, the demon spirits, those spirits that have... Uh, 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 bound up your life has to obey in the name of Jesus hallelujah we speak healing right now in the name of Jesus we speak deliverance right now we speak breakthroughs right now we speak victory in your life in the name of Jesus be thou made whole from the top of your head to the sole of your feet right now in the name of Jesus devil Shut up and let go. Praise the name of God. I rebuke every doubt and every unbelief right now in the name of Jesus. Everything, every words of Satan, I rebuke you right now in the name of the Holy One of God, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Loose and let God's people go right now in Jesus' name. Hallelujah to God. There it is. There it is right there. Hallelujah to God. The devil is obeying right now. <laughs> Hallelujah to God. Somebody's getting a miracle right this very minute. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah to God. You can be going to rejoice and bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Because the devil is obeying God. Hallelujah to God. His promises is yea and amen. Praise God. And Jesus is sitting right next to the Father at the right hand, making sure it is done because he's interceding for you. He is interceding for you. That's what the word said. Praise God. Thank God for the authority of Christ and the authority of his word. Hallelujah. We can stand on him. Hallelujah. We can stand on him. We can trust in the work that he's done, the words that he's spoken. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. These things have been made real in our life through our faith in him. Hallelujah to God that we believe him and we receive him as Lord. Do you know that Jesus is Lord? And if you don't know him, you can get saved right now. You can ask him to come into your heart 
and be your Savior. Praise God. And he will come into your heart and save you from your sins. Hallelujah to God. And write your name down in the Lamb's Book of Life. Praise God. And you can rejoice and thank God that you're saved. Praise God. Thank God for your deliverance. Glory to God. And we bless the Lord with you. Amen. Amen. It has been said down through the ages that knowing God is a complicated issue. The Word of God gives us all that we need to know about Him. Our book, Knowing God Through the Scriptures, will help you understand God in all the aspects of His nature. Using the Scripture as our guide, you will gain a greater insight of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Get your copy of Knowing God Through the Scriptures by going to our website at www.dudleysmith.net or you can call toll-free at 1-800-852-7664. Strengthen the foundation of your faith. Know intimately who God is. Make that purchase right now. We are waiting to hear from you. Hi, this is Linda Smith. For great gospel music by evangelist Dudley Smith, go to www.dudleysmithonline.net and click on the DSM Media tab. You will see the link to our radio station. You'll also hear music from artists like The Crap Family, The Tallies, Donnie Rambo, Janet Paschal, and yes, Dudley Smith. This is Christian Radio at its best. This station is on 24 hours a day. So hurry, come on over and start listening now. You'll be blessed all day long. Well, our time has come and gone for this particular program. We're so happy. Praise God that you were with us and pray that you were blessed of the Lord. We want to take a moment and pray a prayer of faith for you. Praise God, just for you. So let's pray together. Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you, God. Lord, how you bless your people, God. We thank you for your word, Father. Hallelujah, for there's life in your word. It's the bread of life. We thank you for it, Father. Hallelujah. I pray that it minister to all of your sons and daughters that watch this program. Somebody needs a healing in their body, Father. Confirm your word now, Lord, by giving them a miracle, God, right now. A miracle of healing in their body. Somebody needs deliverance and breakthrough. Perform that, God, right now, God. They are desperate and they need your help, God. Do it right now in the name of Jesus, God. And God, we're going to believe you and we're going to receive those things that we have need of from the Lord. We give you praise and we give you glory, Lord, right now for meeting our need, God. And we bless your name in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Praise the name of God. Go ahead and rejoice now that God is meeting your need. Hallelujah to God forevermore. If this program has been a blessing to you in any way, shape or form, we'd love to hear from you. Praise God. You can email us at DudleySmith at BellSouth.net. That's DudleySmith at BellSouth.net. Or if you prefer, you can write us. Love to get mail from you. Uh, you can write us at Dudley Smith Ministries, 607 Cynthia Court, Goldsboro, North Carolina, 27534. That's Goldsboro, North Carolina, 27534. Now, any of the music that we have on uh, this program, the music or books, can be purchased from our website at www.dudleysmithonline.net. Praise God. We appreciate it if you go and you would purchase something, praise God, to help us continue our ministry. Praise God. We look forward to being with you again for another edition of the, the Abiding Word. Be blessed in the Lord today. And remember, we love you and we shall see you again. Thank you.